I'm Angela. This is Sethi. It's October 6th and Sethi's nine months old today. And this is Julie. Say hi, Julie. Hi. Julie is just as aerial. And this is the fall season. All my garden is um, bountiful. We just want to do a tour of the garden and all the things that we planted this year. Right here we have a strawberry patch. I just yes. planted this this year in the raised bed. I didn't get one strawberry, but the strawberries doubled in size. So we'll see if we get strawberries next year. This is our fall root vegetables. Yes. We got some carrots. What's that, Julie? That's spinach. Turnips. Kind of tastes like spinach. So in the fall, we're going in the winter, we're going to eat some turnip greens. We got some beets, a little spinach over here. And over here, we got our grapevine. No grapes, but hopefully one day we'll have some grapes. And this year I added these big arches so I could grow everything vertically because we live in the suburbs. So we wanted to grow as much as we can in a small amount of space. So we built four arches. And this one we got some certified cold beans. And those grew really big. Well, yeah, those grew really well. And I think these are Chinese noodle beans. They said they couldn't be grown in zone five, but we grew them. They were really good. Um, now they're producing beans, but the squirrels keep eating them. But we'll see. Maybe we'll get some beans. I'm letting these all go to seed. So we're going to get some good, yummy beans from those. We had some beans. They were pretty good. We made some southern red beans and rice because I'm from the south. And then we have some, some butternut squash growing down there. That's pretty much and done. And we got some flowers, some zucchini. So our arches yeah. are really nice and pretty this year. And we got gumballs and cherries. Gumballs. She likes to call the ground cherries gumballs. And she eats them like gumballs. Here. That's why it's a great taste sour. Here we got some um, green peppers. Julie, you want to pick some bell peppers? No. You don't? No. Well, we got a lot. I picked a lot of the bell peppers. We got some nice bell peppers. No, 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 no. No. We can collect all of those. And we got some bell peppers growing here. And then and I we just have some, uh, and we have squash. some volunteer morning glories. Those grew right And we crazy. have squash. This, I'm going to wait until almost frost to get all my sweet potatoes. So this is five sweet potato plants I got from from the store. That's the only thing I didn't grow from seed. And they they took off. I had some corn here. The raccoons ate it, so we pulled those up. And now we got this, where I'm growing some lettuce for the fall. We eat off of that. We pick a little lettuce every day. And these are the zucchinis I grew on these arches. So now we just got a whole bunch of vines, but they were and great. This is the you can see some of how the zucchini looks. So the zucchini starts off green like this, and they're beautiful, and they're tasty, and they taste like zucchini. I think they're called tromboncino zucchini. And we ate those all summer, but then they're supposed to be a fall um, squash too. So they kind of look like this. How tall is this, Julie? Is it taller than you? Julie's three feet tall. Whoa! It's about three feet two inches. So we let, took that off the vine. We've been having it here. We let it cure. And, and we're going to taste it as a winter squash. And we have water. And we got one more. Oh! Whoa! That's heavy, Julie. How tall is that one? That one's about three feet. I don't know how these taste as a winter squash, but as a summer squash, they are excellent. They vine. They grow up. They look beautiful. And they're really mild tasting. And they don't get powdery mildew, so I love those. Uh oh, Julie, let's get this one. Oh, yeah. So we pulled up all our butternut squash, and we put them in here so the squirrels and stuff wouldn't eat them while they were they would get nice and hard. And so we got all these butternut squash mm -hmm. here. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, no, six, seven, eight. So we had one no. butternut squash vine, and we got eight butternut squash from that. And that's probably enough for my family. Still got some some um, peppers. Look, come look at these peppers. Still got a bunch of peppers I need to pick. 
and freeze those. This is full of bell peppers because we like bell peppers and jalapeno peppers. So we got those. And oh, last but not least, first year we grew watermelon. So the watermelon is dying, pretty much died. But um, we got about three, four good watermelons. The first couple, the taste was eh, it was okay. How was the taste, should I? Should I say, eh, we're real sweet. It's good. It's good. Oh, Julie said it's good. Tell them it's good. It's good. It was good. So it was horrible. Here. Should I, you want to come get the watermelon for me? We're going to weigh it. That one here. orange glow oh so those orange glows they get real big but we're gonna taste it oh Sethy wants to taste it you want to taste it Sethy how's it taste I'm gonna taste it you want to taste it how is it good this is good is it good Sethy let me okay. taste it you do you wait to October and you get your orange glow watermelons and they're sweet we had two other orange glows and they were super sweet and we were disappointed but Sethy wants some more I'm gonna try to weigh it to see to see how much it weighs in the two pieces since we broke it in half but it's actually sweet should I taste it I swear it's sweet I, I think swear this it's sweet. Is, I think this one's red. She's hard to please. She's seven years old. And she's as Who are you dressed as? Uma! She's dressed as Uma, so she's a villain, so we're never going to please her. So anyway, we got our few watermelons. Mommy. Mommy. What? Tell them it's good. No. It's good! She said, she said secretly it's actually really good. We got all kinds of bell peppers, some beans here. Uh-oh. And squash. So here's our garden. Wow. Flowers. And it's an orange glow. Flowers over here. Mom, we got another orange glow. Pounds and pounds of butternut squash. Another orange glow that fell on the ground. I don't think this one was ready. It fell off the vine, so we're going to just compost that. <laughs> For Sethi, will eat it. He doesn't care if it's sweet. <gasps> She's eating the nucleus! <laughs> and that's our garden. Duh! Thanks for watching. Say bye, Sethi. Bye! Bye! Um, make sure you go to my channel and... In